Russia announced on Tuesday that it will suspend the Strategic Arms Reduction Treaty, or by short, START. And that raises a lot of fears of a renewed arms race in the free world. The START was a bilateral treaty between the United States and the North, uh, Soviet Union on the reduction and the limitation of strategic offensive arms. The treaty was signed on uh, July 31st, 1991 and entered into force on the 5th of December 1994. Uh, the then President Barack Obama and Dmitry Medov signed the new uh, START treaty in 2010. The pact limits each country no more than uh, 1,550 deployed nuclear words and 700 deployed missiles and bombers. The agreement envisages uh, sweeping uh, on-site inspection to verify compliance. On Tuesday, Russian President Vladimir Putin announced that Russia would suspend participation in the New START Treaty, the last central, central pillar of post-Cold War nuclear arms control between Moscow and Washington which limits the strategic nuclear arsenals. Uh, again, it was signed in 2010, and the, the New START Treaty uh, caps the number of uh, strategic nuclear warheads that the United States and Russia may deploy, and the deployment of land and submarine base uh, missiles and bombers to deliver them. And uh, for Russia to suspend this uh, signed treaty is a concern. To U.S., not only to U.S., but uh, to, uh, to the free world. And um, it's just a little concerning. But the only language uh, Putin understand is nuclear. So, with so many nuclear words ready for launch, uh, renewed arms race is the least of my worries. But with Mr. Putin... Things can change.